So, I'm sitting here in my office. Hair's a little wild, but you did click on the right link. Today, I am gonna climb a mountain. I'm going with the kids, and we are gonna climb Sparrowhawk Mountain. And if you wanna see the views, then follow along in this video. Let's go. What's up everybody? So, we just dropped the babies off at their grandparents' house so I can take the big kids to climb the mountain. Who is nervous? Kinda. Little. Yeah, you guys are a little bit nervous. We're gonna find out that there's nothing to be afraid of. Far too often in life we're crippled by fear. When we only fear fear itself, there's nothing to be afraid of. You guys watch, follow along. We're gonna climb the mountain and they're gonna have the best day ever. They're gonna find out that nothing was in the way besides their own fear. Follow along guys. All right, here we are, Sparrowhawk primitive area. We are about to go climb the mountain. How do you feel right now? Excited and nervous. Excited and nervous. Lily, how do you feel? Good. You feel nervous, good? Nervous, um, some, yeah. All right, here we go. We'll show you the map as we're about to climb, and then let's get to climbing. Let's go. Three. So, I was wrong. This is not where we're hiking. I've got it on my phone now, so we'll get to the right place. Little detours. Life happens. So, I'm really bummed out to, we were at the right place, come to find out. Driving around, using enough internet, and calling the wildlife department. That being said, you have to have your hunting and fishing license to hike the mountain. I don't want to hunt when I get up there. I don't want to fish whenever I go up there. I want to take my kids to see the views and I have to have my Oklahoma State hunting and fishing license. I don't understand. It doesn't make sense to me. Maybe somebody can explain to me in the comments below. But now I'm stuck trying to find something else fun to do with my big kids. It's a real bummer. A real letdown it's crazy or you have to have a wildlife conservative conservation passport I don't even know what that is all of it costs money there's no way to go hiking for free what a bummer catch you later on in the video all right we are back for round two but I've got the right paperwork that lets us go up. If Lily will go over there and show you the sign, what I had to do before we could get this done. All right. Definitely bear out here. There's bear out here, but we're not bear, worried about bears when I'm a beast. So I find that this hike is a lot more intrusive than I thought. So far, not the great views that I was hoping for, but great wildlife great. in the middle of the woods. It is so hot in Oklahoma right now. And dry. And whew, humid, not yeah, dry. It's not like muggy and stuff. Yeah, but my heart yeah, is about to beat out of my chest. Uh, I don't see any way to get around this. So we're gonna have to just take our chances. We're too far in the trail now to turn around. We will improvise. Woo! You got it, sister. You all right? Yeah. Yeah, I got invisible lap syndrome. We'll just keep going. So, it feels like we've been hiking forever. But as you can see, we just hit the half mile mark. And I'm beat. <sighs> Oklahoma, 95 degree weather. About 70% humidity, but we're starting to see the break. See some blue skies and the it's edge like soon. Right Catch you in a minute. So, all that walking 
is now worth it. So it's about a half a mile up. You pass that tree with a half a mile, it's another 10 steps. Holy smokes. Look at that. The waterway over there and the yeah. clear green grass. I am very scared. Oh, no. If you look way down there, you can see floaters. Yeah. Yeah. Unbelievable. We are so high. I'm burning up. Yeah, it's hot. So, with all due respect, and truly, I walked to the tree that has some shoes here. And it says, parting came and hearts were broken. A loved one left with words unspoken. Deep in our heart, there's a memory kept for a son, husband, brother, friend that we'll never forget. Someday we hope to meet you, someday we know not when. To clasp your hands in better land, never to part again. In loving memory, David Paul Moyer, 1957 to April 2016. Whew, we are again so high. Okay, I don't know where we are, but we're some point to see if there's a good lookout. Bet, go up to the right, see if there's a lookout. Mm -hmm. Follow the trail. This is a trail. Ha, don't go that way, go up. No. Yes. Hey bud, we don't let fear control us. I do. Fear, no we don't. Come on son, you can do this. It's okay to feel fear. It's not okay to be crippled by it. You can do this, son. I promise you, you can do this. Holy smokes. Now the fear, the result of that fear is Look we're safe. House. Look at this. Look at that house off in the distance. Look it down. And there's the Illinois River. This view really is incredible. Well, this view was completely worth it. Yeah, unbelievably beautiful up here. Okay, we are heading to the trail. Keep going straight and to the left. So, we made it down the mountain. We conquered a little bit of fear, but I failed. I failed today because I've been lifting weights since November, and I lift hard. I'm getting strong, I'm getting the results I wanted. I simply just was not in cardiovascular enough shape to complete this trek. I'm really bummed. I'm let down, let down on myself, but I'm not going to give up. We're going to start trying this mountain once a week. So another reason we gave up, 98 degrees Fahrenheit, Tahlequah, Oklahoma, with like 60% humidity. Oh, it's getting ugly out. So you've made it this far in the video thank you be sure to hit that like button and subscribe i wanted to end the day in today's video with a message and the message is two lessons i hope you take from this video one don't let fear control you you can't it will cripple you what you think you are afraid of there's really no reason to be afraid of it face it come out the other side grow from the experience two two what i want you to learn is cardio is important you can be strong you can set prs and lifting weights but if you're not strong here cardiovascular wise you gotta make it a priority and i learned the hard way so i got some things to do some things to work on i'm gonna get after it See you guys at the next video.